The wishes of Moff Sarek, the officer entrusted with annexing this planet. He has been anticipating your arrival. Bring me up to speed. I would not presume to answer that. The Moff can explain to you himself. Good day. You have served us before, have you not? A valuable hire. I expect you care little for the niceties of politics here, so I will be brief. The Empire intends to use Alderaan's succession struggle to bring it into the fold, and I'm offering you the opportunity to play a pivotal role. What's the situation? The heir to Alderaan's throne was recently assassinated, right after withdrawing from the protection of the Republic. The planet's in civil war, and for the first time in thousands of years, without the armies of the Republic to bring order. That's a long time. Has the Republic really given them up? The Republic has its proxies here, as we have ours. We have allied ourselves with House Thal. The House was exiled 60 years ago after a failed bid for power, and came to us instead. Unfortunately, they have proven too weak to do what's needed. Perhaps we should trust their methods. If Alderaan is to be part of the Empire, they must learn what that means. Jorad, one of the Thal Lords, insists on following Alderaan's rules of civilized warfare. I want you to show him warfare is far from civil. Several of Thal's vassal houses have rebelled since Thal's connection to us became public. This cannot be allowed. Take a slave collar from my man here and drag one of these rebels to our weak-willed Lord Thal. Kill the rest and leave them where they fall. These Alderaan lordlings will beg to serve the Empire. These lords of Alderaan must lose their foolish pride. Those who will not bow must break. What is good? Who... Crimar! Is that Crimar Noven? That's a free nobleman of Alderaan. Unhand him. Who are you? W what, what's this about? <gasps> Moff Sarek sent me to round up these traitors. Uh, 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 yes. Moff Sarek had suggested using tactics like... Um... All of Alderaan will be thrown into chains because of you! If you cannot rule your own vassals, how will you rule a planet? You heard that. Be silent if you wish any mercy. I am not certain that someone of your profession should make this sort of decision. Uh... I make this decision. Sir. Too bad I'll miss the fun. Indulge me. I am inspired by the success of your last task. I would like to offer you a commission. Be my representative in House Thul. Aid Jorad and his men in crushing all resistance to the Empire. Obey her as you would me, and with the same penalty for defiance. Tell her what must be done to secure Thul's hold on Alderaan. Yes, sir. Uh, my lady. What's the next step? I suppose the Moff expects us to take on House Organa. They're one of our oldest noble houses and loyal to the Republic. Until recently they've been without an army, but they've got supporters all over the planet. Uh, including here. You'll never find them. They've got top-of-the-line cloaking better than anything the Empire makes. No probes will get through, no spy sats, nothing! I'm smarter than a probe droid. House Organa denied raising an army, claiming it's just patriots defending their lands. But their attacks are too organized. We'll never find every group. We need to get inside their planet-wide communications, and that means finding a base with a physical link to slice into. Whatever. I'm on the clock. How can you destroy the culture of an entire world and call it a mere day of work? Silence! If you stand with the Organas, you betray a thousand years of loyalty. The Organa guerrillas have a base hidden in some cave or other natural camouflage. There should be a master comlink there, guarded by their best soldiers. If you insert this computer spike, it'll give us a backdoor into all their communications. 
If we slice into their command center, we can avoid falling into any traps. House Organa will not make another move without us knowing. Impressive work. You can see we now have access to the Organa systems. They're all talking about the, uh, the ruthlessness and brutality of the recent attack. They, uh, they do train you Imperials well, don't they? They fight with the fervor of patriots. The Organas are trusted here. Many people have joined their resistance. Now that we can monitor the Organas' communications, it should be possible to... Lord Thulch, the base is under attack. Send aid quickly. Order outpost 2 under attack. I repeat, under attack. Perimeter defense is breached. We're under attack by assault droids. Repeat, a coordinated attack by probe and assault droids. Blood of the Queen. There's an attack on one of your bases? One we can handle. The data feeds are showing all three of our border outposts are under attack. A coordinated assault, hunter killers and probe droids. All I've got out there is a skeleton crew. You're the only one close enough to reach them in time. Please, save my bases and bring me the memory cores from any probes you destroy. I want to know who's behind this. Good luck. I'll bring you the heads of those droids and their master. Thank you. Now hurry! I cannot thank you enough for your quick work. I don't know what the Organas were after, but that attack was long in the planning. I'm always a professional. Moff Sarek was wise to hire you. No one else on Alderaan acts with your swift brutality. Who's the source of these? What were they looking for? And quickly! The programming signatures point to Lord Cedric Kilesa. Lord is my vassal. He swore loyalty to me personally when we returned from exile. Were the droids after something in particular? The parameters indicate the probes were to join an assault team in a... My lord, this program indicates an assault team massing in a tunnel between here and the Kalisa Estates. I don't find any such tunnel on the blueprint. The siege tunnel! Blood of a queen! They're coming through the siege tunnel! I need more intel than what you're giving me. There's an old tunnel between here and Cedric's estate. It was the escape route in ancient times in case of a siege. No one's used it in centuries, but the tunnel opens right under this room. What are we going to do? Defeating a standing army goes for time and a half. Yes, of course, whatever. This is my family's home. Moff Sarek gave us cartons of thermite explosives. They take time to set up, but they, they pack a punch. If you take them into the siege tunnel, you can collapse it on Cedric and his army. Seal the access, so they can't threaten us again. Let's make this happen. I don't know what I'd do without you here. There's an entrance to the tunnel nearby. The storeroom is in the same area. I'll recall my troops to defend the surface, but there's no doubt the real battle will be below. Thank you. So, you're the Imperial puppet who taught Jorad Thule to bite instead of bark. Does he lick your hand? Fetch your slippers? Real Alderanians will never bow to the likes of you. Yield, and you may keep your title in your lands. I would sooner see Alderaan blasted into space debris than given over to the Empire. You don't even have the guts to fight this yourself instead of hiding behind a cart and a thermite. If you had a shred of decency, you'd settle this by an honorable duel. You against me. You against me. You surprise me, Bounty Hunter. I thought your kind couldn't change their minds unless they're paid to. A duel of skill, then. If you win, I will give my house over to Jorah Thule to use as he will. If I win, you stand aside and let me cleanse Alderaan of this scourge, and tell your Imperial handlers Alderaan lives free or dies! To arms! I... concede. You have the better skill. Perhaps it is Alderaan's fate to fall to the Empire. I will tell my people. We must find a way to live through these times. Show them that sometimes there is more strength in yielding. I will tell my army to stand down. Thank you for this mercy. The Kalejas just surrendered. 
My men are returning from the outpost to take them into custody. The Kalazers are saying you are a woman of great honor. I will tell Moff Selleck of your heroism immediately. Remember my name. Spread it around. I will make sure of that. The Thals need not fear any further rebellion in their ranks. If the Empire is to keep you a retainer, our money would better go toward using you elsewhere. A General Stunnel Thal is coordinating our efforts near House Ald. Speak to him if you'd like to take a further role in this conquest. You have saved my house's dream of ruling our world, and taught me much about what that will mean. I will not forget. Stanel Thul, I was told you want to see me. Yes, Moff Sarek said you'd be here. We've had an inspection team lost to the Killix for days now, advisors from Droman Kaas. They were inspecting one of our mining sites for lanthanide deposits. But in the middle of their inspection, the entire place was overrun by Killix. We've had no communication for days. I want the full briefing. Risk assessment, strategic importance, all of it. Moff Sarek wants the inspection team rescued, and fast. Apparently some of them hold serious rank off-world. And the Killix don't exactly respond to negotiations. They're the native aliens here. Giant bugs with just enough sentience to shoot a blaster. Attacking these Killix would take half our army, but apparently I'm too close to the problem to strategically assess its value. You have some kind of personal stake in this? Yes. I... I don't want you to think I'm asking for personal reasons, but my daughter was leading the inspection team. I don't know if she's alive or dead. If you can find her, find our advisors, free them if they're prisoners, I promise you a reward that will leave me bankrupt. I will not let these aliens kill your daughter, or the advisors. Thank you. For myself, even more than for my house. You have removed those who are not of the nest. Had they stayed, they would have learned the peace of the joining. We will not deny you your prize. But leave now. There has been a song of swarming. We have claimed these mines for the nest. I'm looking for Stan Thule's daughter. Once we were called Daria Thule. Now we are known as New Child of the Ukanuku Nest. We have tasted the gel and scented the egg chamber. We have joined. I'm getting you out of here. You are mistaken. We are not here against our will. We have joined the kind. There is peace in the nest. A love that comes of sharing one mind. It is a gift beyond measure. We will never return. You've confused me with someone who cares. Here we are safe. Here we are at peace. Here we will stay. Come with me, or die, along with every Killik here. That's your only option. No, we will never. We are hearing the voice of the Nest. We have decided it is not worth many losses to save one. The Nest has spoken. We will return. Thank you. My medics are treating the inspection team for shock, but they seem otherwise unharmed. I wish I could say the same for my daughter. It is clear those monsters have drugged her, brainwashed her. I've heard of this, something in the pheromones that joins their captives to their hive mind. She may still recover. Be patient with her. I only wish I could have protected her. General Thule, excuse me. It is urgent I speak with my rescuer at once. I'm Agent Craig Graf, Imperial Intelligence. It was no accident those Killicks attacked when they did. The Ulgos pushed them toward that mine. How'd you arrive at that? We've been monitoring communications between the Ulgo strike teams in that region. This was definitely planned. The push was orchestrated by the Ulgos to distract us from something they're calling Operation Sunshower. I suggest we make sure their plan doesn't work. I've heard that term. It's come up a few times in the chatter we're getting from our back door into the Organa networks. It's a beradium detonator, a massive explosive. They plan to strike at the heart of Full Lands. The detonator's being transported by Boris Ulgo's elite soldiers, former Republic Special Forces, with the best weapons they could take and all the training the Republic gave them. 
Kill the soldiers, steal the weapon? Just before the Killix arrived, we acquired a data file that I believe to be the launch codes for the detonator. If you really wish to strike fear into the heart of the Ulgos, get into the camp where they're holding it and set it off prematurely. It won't be the full force of the weapon, but let it be Ulgo that perishes, not Thul. Thank you. You are again Thul's savior, saving our lands from devastation and death. I had wondered why an outsider was entrusted with so many secrets of the Empire. Now I see there is no one else whose abilities compare. I've had way tougher jobs. Then we must bow to your skill even more, for it is more than any of our troops could do. The Ulgos have retreated to mourn their casualties. Perhaps I should do the same. My superiors have been asking about you. There is some intrigue happening with House Wrist. Trouble for our allies. If you're interested, look for Dathis Elgin. Moff Sarak has already commended you to him. Ah, Hunter. Dathis Elgin, Imperial Advisor to House Thule. Am I glad to see you? House Thule faces a crisis that threatens to undermine their entire position on Alderaan. And the Empires as well. You'll have to tell me what this crisis is before I agree to anything. House Rist, Alderaan's House of Assassins, is currently aligned with the usurper House Ulgo. But there was a time when Rist did all manner of secret jobs for whomever paid. Now the dirty details of those jobs are threatening to get out. Next time, don't hire assassins. Every noble house on Alderaan has done underhanded things. A fool is not unique. A former Rist assassin, kicked out for revealing the identity of one of his employers, is blackmailing Thul. He says he'll reveal every assassination, every kidnapping, every conniving thing Thul has done unless we pay him. What made you pick me to talk to? We've arranged a meeting to deliver payment. But he's recruited some of Rist's best assassins to his side. I don't trust him. That's why I need you. Someone strong enough to withstand whatever trap he intends to spring. So what exactly do I do? This man wants to establish his own House of Assassins. And he has demanded land and a title as payment for his silence. Take this case and meet him at the assigned meeting place. If he takes the bribe, fine. If not, kill him. Well, brother, would you look at this. A bounty hunter. Well, what do you know? Thul isn't half as stupid as I thought. It won't do them any good, but I give them points for trying. Now, if you'd kindly hand over the payment. I'm not giving you a thing until I'm sure there are no tricks. Tricks? We've only just met. You already know me so well. I thought Thul would send some scrawny diplomat I could take hostage, but you... you'll fetch a higher price. I'm going to enjoy kicking your face in. Don't get your hopes up. We've been doing this our whole Stop. lives. Stop this, Kai. She has the better of us, and besides, it's not worth it. The evidence is already on its way to House Ulgo. He had no intention of giving it to you. Don't expect me to leave without getting what I came for. Sam, you idiot! We could have been counts! You've lost all sense of honor. Lying and stealing? I swore to live by a code! The wonder with the evidence is delivering it to Olgo's son, Vesix. Sam, you'd betray your own brother? I'll kill you for that! Damn it, Kai. I'm sorry. Look, the coordinates the runner was headed to are in the console over there. You might be able to catch him if you hurry. I'll take Kai's assassins. I promise, neither you nor Thule will hear from us again. We won't be so merciful a second time. I won't forget it. We owe House Thule a big favor. Good luck recovering that evidence. I take the fact that you're rummaging around in the Assassin's files to mean that the meeting didn't go well. The Assassin tried to take me hostage. I expected as much. Spare no detail. If Vesix Ulgo gets that evidence, 
Soon every house on Alderaan will know who Thul hired Riss to kill and when. They won't just banish Thul, they'll destroy them. And the Empire's chances on Alderaan will die with them. Just give me a chance to find Ulgo and stop them from distributing the evidence. That may be easier said than done. Vesex Uldo commands a squad of the most highly trained commandos on Alderaan. They have even defeated Jedi. But you... You may stand a chance. I have to ask you to recover that evidence. Quickly. I won't let you down. Thank you so much. Find the evidence. Destroy it. And I promise you double the reward when you return. <laughs> Tell me you've defeated Vesix. Tell me you managed to destroy the evidence of Thul's misdeeds before Ulgo was able to distribute it. Thul's secrets are safe. Never in my entire life have I been so relieved. Here is a reward from House Thul. You've done a great thing for the Empire. I hope you realize that. <laughs>